Today we're going to be doing Progress Monitoring Unit 2, Week 3. I'll say the words and you can repeat after me. Okay, we have two vowels go walking, so it's going to say E. Eat. Eat. No. No. Of. Of. Under. Under. Who. Who. So the W is quiet and we know the two O's is like our little cheese sandwich that we say in class that says ooh. Who. Who? Okay, so now we have to blend a lot of letters together. If you know how to say it, you could say it the fast way. I'm going to sound it out, and you guys say it the fast way. Brand. 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 Send. 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 Pink. 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 Junk. 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 Plant. 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 Went. 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 De ask. De ask. Desk. Just. 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 Stamp. 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 Drink. 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 Okay, let's try to read the sentences and phrases. What do you like to eat? What, what do you like to eat? No, you cannot send that. No, you cannot send that. The trunk has a lot of junk in it. The trunk has a lot of junk in it. The dog went the under the bed. The dog went under the bed. Who just came in with a pink plant? Who just came in with a pink plant? Okay, now we're going to go to the Wonders Readers Writers Workshop. This is for Unit 2, Week 3. And we're going to be reading a story called The Best Spot. The essential question is, where do animals live together? And because we're seeing pictures of real animals and they're going to give us facts and details, it is nonfiction. It is a true story. My turn, your turn. The best spot. The best spot. Okay, when it goes directly to the story, <clears throat> my turn, your turn. So, what do you guys see in the first picture? A deer. A deer. What is he eating? Grass. Grass. Good observation. Do you think he's in the city or in a forest? A, a forest. forest. Yes, there's no buildings around. Let's read the sentences. My turn, your turn. This is a forest. This is a forest. This spot has lots of animals. This spot has lots of animals. Deer live here. Deer live here. They eat plants. They eat plants. Okay, who's in our first picture? A deer. What does he eat? Plants. <clears throat> Who do you think is in our next picture? A rabbit. A, a rabbit. rabbit. Okay. But who's in the grass? But who's in the grass? A rabbit's head pops up. A rabbit's head pops up. <clears throat> what do you see in the next picture? What's this? Little. A mama bird and little birds, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So. I think she's feeding him a worm. When I was little, I used to collect worms to feed my bird. What is up there? What is up there? Look. Up, up, up. Look. Up, 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 up. It is a nest. It is a nest. The mom gets big bugs. The mom gets big bugs. Yum. Yum. Yes, I guess birds must love to eat them. I thought it was a worm. Was my prediction right? Yeah. No, but I learned in this picture they're eating bugs. Where does the bird live? In the nest. And where does the mom bring the babies? The big bugs. The bugs, yep. What is on the trunk? What is on the trunk? What do you guys think this could be? A nest. It's a nest, but it's not for a bird. Let's find out. It is a nest, too. It is a nest, too. Lots of wasps live in it. Lost of wasps living in it. Yeah, it's kind of insect, and this is where they live, in a nest, on the trunk of a tree. This is tricky, because my car has a trunk where I put my groceries, 
but a trunk can also be the part of a tree, right? Yeah. Okay, what do we see on the next page? What do you think these guys are? Ants. Ants. My turn. Ants live here too. Ants live here too. Ants pick up twigs and grass. Ants pick up twigs and grass. Ants zip in and out. Ants zip in and out. Ants have no rest. Ants have no rest. Okay, what are the ants picking up? Um, like twigs. Twigs, twigs and, and grass. grass. Okay, and it says they have no rest because they're busy and they're working all the time. Oh, look at this. I see their nest is labeled the way in, ants digging, queen ant, egg, and food. Ants dig under sand and grass. Ants dig under sand and grass. Oh, look how cute these are. What do you think these guys are? Fox. Fox, yeah. And when they're babies, they call them a kit. Fox kits hop on a stump. Fox kids hop on a stump. So a stump is like a tree that's been chopped down. What's left is called the stump. Mom fox, Mom fox lets the kids, lets the kids run and jump. Run and jump. <clears throat> the kids must eat. The kids must <clears throat> eat. Dad fox hunts at dusk. Dad fox hunts at dusk. Hmm. Is dusk when the sun goes up or when the sun goes down? Down. Very good. So as it approaches nighttime, he begins to hunt. And what does a mom let the kids do? Run and jump. Yeah, perfect. Who do you think this guy is over here? A <clears throat> Yeah. And when he raises his tail, be careful. If he's afraid, he might defend himself. Is it going to smell sweet like perfume or stinky? Stinky. Who went hunting to? Who went hunting to? A skunk. A skunk. This spot has lots of animals. This spot has lots of animals. Okay. And we're done with our story for today. The main topic was lots of animals live in the forest. And you can talk about different details that happen in the story. Okay. The next story for this week is going to be from our anthology book. Okay, the same essential question. Where do animals live together? Where do animals live together? And it's a true story because it's nonfiction. We're going to learn facts about what happens in the pond. And we see the pictures. My turn, your turn. At a pond. At a pond. By Nancy Finton. By Nancy Finton. Who lives at a pond? Who lives at a pond? Who is under the water? Who is under the water? Who is on the land? Who is on the land? Who can fly to the pond? Who can fly to the pond? Can you guys think of one animal that might be under the water? Uh, alligator. Ooh, an alligator. Wow. What do you think? Um, fish. Fish? What about a turtle? Mm -hmm. Okay, who can be here next to the pond? Ducks. Oh, ducks. I didn't think about that. Good idea. And who can fly around? Ducks. Oh, birds. And I was thinking a dragonfly, too. Ooh, who could be on the lily pad? Frogs. Hmm, let's see if we're right. Ooh, guess my brain. Frogs live at a pond. Frogs live at a pond. They swim and hop and jump. They swim and hop and jump. Frogs rest on plants. Frogs rest on plants. On the pond. On the pond. What is one thing they do? They rest on plants and they swim. Oh, perfect. You gave me two. And what's the other thing they do? They hop and jump. Ooh, what do you think he likes to eat? Bugs. Bugs. Let's find out. This frog is hunting for bugs. This frog is hunting for bugs. It sees a bug. It sees a bug. Will it get a snack? Will it get a snack? It has to be quick. It has to be quick. Yum, yum. Yum, yum. I guess I like that snack. Oh, what do you guys see here? Ducks. Yeah. And they, what are they doing here? 
Yeah, and then if they want to get something, they could put their beak in the water. Sometimes they call it, well, or their bill, sorry. Ducks come to the pond. Ducks come to the pond. They eat lots of bugs and plants. They eat lots of bugs and plants. The duck dips its bill. The duck dips its bill. To get bugs. To get bugs. Dip, dip, dip. Dip, dip. Dip. So this part of their mouth, they call it a bill, and that's what he dips in to get bugs. What do you see this mama has here in this small picture? Eggs. Eggs. And who are these? Chicks. chicks. The little chicks. Ducks make a nest on land. Ducks make a nest on land. They use twigs and grass. They use twigs and grass. Who is in the egg? Who is in the eggs? Oh, I forgot the yes. Let's try that again. Who is in the eggs? Who is in the eggs? Quack, quack, quack. Quack, quack, quack. What do they use to make the nest? Twigs and grass. Perfect. Who do we see on the rocks? Turtles. Turtles. Turtles can be on land and in water. Turtles can be on land and water. They swim and swim. They swim and swim. Then they stop and rest in the sun. Then they, they stop, stop and rest in the sun. sun. Okay, so we predicted that there would be turtles at the pond, and you guys had fish too. Good job. Okay, can a fish be on land? Can a fish be on land? No. No. Fish live in water. Fish live in water. They swim, swim, swim. They swim, swim, swim. A big fish comes up to eat. A big fish comes up to eat. Gulp. Gulp, gulp. Who do you think this could be? A dragonfly. Maybe a dragonfly? I thought so too. Let's find out. Bugs like water. Bugs like water. Lots of bugs. Lots of bugs. Live at a pond. Live at a pond. A dragonfly is a big bug. A dragonfly is a big bug. You can see it at a pond. You can see it at a pond. Look at the animals at a pond. Who are they? Look at Captions. Them. Egret. Raccoon. Newt. Goldfish. Toad. Beaver. The key to reading is repetition. I hope you enjoy this and I'll see you guys next week.